What's up? Tyler G from Batman TAS Figs on Instagram. Today's review is one that I've been looking forward to a long time, as I'm sure those of you that collect these figures have also waited for it a long time. It's a Batman the Animated Series Batwing, and it looks really good. So, let's get to it. Alright, finally, you can see it for yourselves. We have the Batman Animated Series Batwing. It's been forever. I put a pre-order in in March. I've been waiting every day for this. It is absolutely humongous. I put it next to the Batmobile for size comparison and it just dwarfs it. Absolutely beastly. Alright, so first let's take a look at the box before we get too much into the actual plane. There's the artwork on the front. Very cool. And on the side, you have a little bit of the stuff that it comes with, or the little details. Comes with a little claw that comes out, like in the Feet of Clay episode, we first see that. The dashboard looks amazing, especially when it's lit up. And it shows you it comes with wheels so that you can have uh, landing gears if you need it. And the back of the box. So the wet, the artwork of the plane. And the side, the standard Batman silhouette. Alright, so let's get into the actual Batwing. Oh my goodness. It looks absolutely clean. Absolutely beautiful. It's just sleek. Ugh. Sorry, but I have been waiting for this forever. Alright, we're going to open up the cockpit. And you can see two seats, but when you first open it, you actually won't see two seats. You'll see this little thing put in its place. So you can make it a Batman on his solo missions. Or Batman when he has his buddy Robin with him. It's pretty cool. Let's take a look at the inside of the cockpit. Buttons and lights everywhere. little globe tracking system and unless you have um, the Batman that came with the bat signal with Robin the soft cape version I highly doubt you're gonna be able to get Batman in there without taking off his cape it's really hard with the bendy cape that the first waves came with to actually fit him in there I haven't tried Robin yet with the cape but I'm pretty sure DC collectibles want you to buy that soft cape version Alright, so let's take a look at the front. Oh man. The reason we show you the front too is to show you the little retractable claw that comes out. It's actually articulated. You can open up. You can use it to interrogate people. Recreate those scenes where he's interrogating people over the ocean with it, like feet of clay. Then if you excuse me for a moment as I put this down. Alright, now I'm going to show you the underside. Put this back. And I'll show you how you get the wheels out. You just put that down, pop that out, open the side of this, pop that wheel out, make sure you put it back down, pop the third wheel out, that's how that looks when you pull them out. This is how it looks with the wheels down. Man, it is a beautiful, beautiful piece. If you're collecting these, you gotta have this. This is a must. 
And I'm telling you, I'm telling you right now, it is not even remotely as big as it looks on it. Like, it is way bigger than the camera is making it look. This is a table for eight people, and it is taking up almost the whole table. When you guys see it, I think you guys are going to be amazed. I hope this gave you a, a good idea of what it looks like and how it works. And hopefully next week I get to give another review. Hopefully there's some toys coming out, some figs for Batman the Animated Series. Um, if you guys want to see more pictures of it, they'll be on my Instagram tomorrow. My Instagram is Batman T-A-S Figs. And like I've said before, I'm not a big YouTuber. So if you want to see my actual passion and what I like to do, it's uh, taking the toy photography and recreating scenes with that so go on over there check me out if you like this video also leave comments if you have any questions Whew, man that looks good all right that's all for me today hope to see you guys soon